her nap yet? Oh, no. She was very tired. You know, it's a long drive down from Carmel. Uh, there's your father's car. Come on, Sally. You'd better get ready for dinner. Oh, can I stay until you tell him Aunt Charlotte's here? I love to see the color returns when he's angry. <laughs> Sally, up, up and away. Come on. Every time there's an emotional crisis around here, I'm in the bathroom washing my hands. <laughs> Shoot. Huh? Hi, Daddy. Have a nice day. Up till now. <laughs> see this little tear? Every time I see you, I weep for joy. <laughs> oh, you like that? Well, when you laugh, you're my gal, Sal. Hey, I'm laughing too. What about me? <laughs> I always save the best for my real gal. <laughs> Martha, I want you to call the liquor store and order a couple of bottles of sake and get out your best kimono. <laughs> Tomorrow night, we're entertaining Mr. Tamura. A Japanese? Oh, you guessed. <laughs> Who is he? Tamura owns some of the biggest silk mills in Kyoto. He's here looking for legal representation. Could mean a very healthy retainer. I'll get a case of sake. Now, what should I cook? Something Japanese. You know any Japanese dishes? Uh, no, but uh, Charlotte does. I could ask her. Good. Whatever it is, just throw it on the floor. They love it that way. <laughs> As a matter of fact, uh, Charlotte called today. Oh, did she use the phone or just throw open the window? <laughs> she said she was thinking of driving down. What? what? Is Howie home? He can help me start putting up roadblocks. <laughs> She'll hear you. In, in Carmel? She's not in Carmel. She's upstairs. Upstairs? Oh, my back just buckled. <laughs> What the devil is that? It's my needlepoint. I'll get it out of your way. No, don't leave it. With Charlotte here, I may want to throw myself on it again. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. Hi, kids. Is Aunt Charlotte up yet? No, she'll be down in a minute. She's going for a dip before dinner. Hallie, get ready to refill the pool. <laughs> Here she comes. Now, please, Paul, she's your sister. Please be nice. I'll be nice and drunk. <laughs> Paul, the bar is closed. Hey, remember the last time you were here, Aunt Charlotte? You taught me how to make wine in a milk bottle? <laughs> Aunt Charlotte. Oh, you look good. Charlotte, darling, how are you? Junior. <laughs> I got a belated wedding present for you kids. Oh, for us? Oh, it shouldn't have. Fantastic. I got it. I got it. Do I hear a little ticking? <laughs> <laughs> he always had that unique sense of humor. <laughs> Other kids used to hit him a lot. <laughs> oh, it's just what Howie and I needed. There are headstands for practicing yoga. One for each of you. If they're going to stand on their heads, they'll need three. <laughs> Charlotte, you're really something special. Why don't you go for your swim while I'm getting dinner ready? All right. Uh, Charlotte, you realize this isn't the bathe in the buff beach club of Carmel. I hope you're wearing something under that robe. Oh, what a ridiculous thing to say. I hope. I'll say it's ridiculous. You know perfectly well I always swim in the raw. Uh, Charlotte, if you swim in the nude around here, the neighbors will go into shock. And we have two full-time peeping toms on this block. I know. I spotted them with my telescope. Darling, you know what's wonderful about Charlotte? She seems to get younger every time I see her. Yes. Hope you're stocked up on pablum. <laughs> Martha, I don't want her around when we're entertaining Mr. Tamura tomorrow night. No telling what she'll say or do. I, I, now, will you stop carrying on about Charlotte? <clears throat> Everyone but you finds her charming and amusing. Try freaky. <laughs> oh, who's freaky? Uh, well, well, we were uh, just discussing... Uh, our uh, kids. Oh, you should be proud of them. They're individuals, and they're on their way. Uh, Charlotte, speaking of being on your way. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Probably.
probably arthritis, an enemy of old age. <laughs> By the way, would you mind if I made a call to the kennel at Carmel? I want to talk to Buster. The sound of my voice keeps him from getting homesick. <laughs> and I'll reverse the charges. You're going to call your dog and reverse the charges? <laughs> Suppose he doesn't accept. Of course, Charlotte, you can call anywhere. Maybe that's Buster calling you. <laughs> Charlotte, you can use Howie and Barbara's phone. All right. May I? Help yourself. Thanks. Hello. Oh, hi, JJ. Yes, Mr. Tamura's coming to dinner tomorrow night. Well, I'll, I'll explain why you're out of town. Yes, I know what this means to us. Yes, yes, we'll have plenty of sake. <laughs> we'll, we'll even get kimonos. Well, I don't think that's any problem because Howie speaks Japanese. That's right. <laughs> I got the only son-in-law who's out of work in five different languages. <laughs> right. Well, you have a good trip. <coughs> Goodbye. Oh, Howie, I, I want to ask you something. H how would a Japanese say hello? Oh, well, usually they say, hello. <laughs> Teach me goodbye to you in any language. <laughs> Actually, hello in Japanese is Ohio. Oh, oh, hi, yo. Very good. <laughs> oh, hi, yo. Wisconsin. <laughs> When's the supper show, Martha Ray? <laughs> now, how would you say, um, pleased to meet you, Mr. Tamura? Tamura? Is he any relation to the Tamura Silk Mills in Kyoto? <laughs> he is the Tamura Silk Mills. Uh, what do you know about him? Well, when I was in the Navy, I visited his silk mills. Oh, boy, they could certainly use you over there, Aunt Charlotte. Do you know what he pays the women who works in his mills? About $2 a day. Why, that's disgraceful. Who is this Tamara? He's going to be our dinner guest tomorrow night. What? Martha, you're not going to cook dinner for a male chauvinist like that. <laughs> I know I certainly will not sit at the same table with him. Sure you won't change your mind. Uh, uh, she means, can we be sure you won't change your mind? I certainly admire your cool, Aunt Charlotte, but do you think it's wise? After all, Mr. Tamura is a potential client of Daddy's. Well, we must fight the enemy wherever we meet him. Now, uh, how does this look? <laughs> Up with nylon. You're taking a position against silkworms? No, against exploiters of women and of many other instances. You know? Where's the march tonight? Hope it's headed for Carmel. <laughs> Dad? Dad, is it okay if I take Sally to dinner with Barbara and me? Well, aren't you forgetting Aunt Charlotte? Oh, here's ten dollars. Take her to that organic place. You'll love it. They feature French fried watercress on a stick. Didn't I tell you? I changed my mind. I'm having dinner with you. Oh, oh no, believe me, Charlotte, you'd be bored to tears. All you'd hear is a lot of legal talk. And besides, uh, Martha only made dinner for three. Oh, I could care less. You know, as a matter of fact, I'm fasting today. And I like to give my body a change of pace once a week. What was it this week, elephant walk? <laughs> Okay. Well, we're gonna cut out now. Sayonara, Simson. Sayonara. Aw, <laughs> oh, Daddy, you're such a ham. <laughs> but he brings home the bacon. <laughs> have fun. Here See you now. Are. Some Japanese yummies. Oh, I could have made some raw fish balls. Charlotte, I remember the time you baked a wedding cake. That night, the bride and groom slept in separate hospitals. <laughs> check the table. And listen, you two, no fighting in the clinches and watch those low blows at all times. Charlotte, we don't always see eye to eye, but surely you realize, basically, I, I, I love and, and respect you. Uh, so would you do me a very big favor, sis? Oh, for you, Polly, anything. Well, when Mr. Tamora gets here, disappear. <laughs> to say a word. Good. And, and don't worry. I, I'll tell him you're deaf. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What's, what's deaf in Japanese? Uh, he's here. I get your kimonos and, and kick off your shoes. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, Oahu. Uh, Tom, we're our son. Mr. Sims? See, si. I mean, yes. Uh, may I take your shoes? No, but you may take my coat. A great pleasure to meet you. It's so good of you to have me to dinner. Well, my, my pleasure. Ah, Mrs. Sims, I presume. Oh, uh, no, me? No, well, uh, no, I'm uh, Mr. Sims' sister, Charter. Uh, Charlotte. Potter. Charlotte Potter. Charmed. I had no idea I was going to have such a lovely dinner companion. <laughs> Forgive me for staring, but you look remarkably like someone I once knew. Who, the Buddha? <laughs> How flattering of you. I mean, I hope, I mean, should I be? Well, I was referring to my late wife. She was very, very beautiful. Oh, oh she was not. Oh, I don't mean that. <laughs> What I mean is, I don't know what I mean. Oh, oh Mr. Tamora, this is my wife, Martha. Ohio. Oh, forget it, honey. <laughs> Charm. Oh, uh, uh, Paul, have you forgotten to serve drinks? Oh, oh sorry. Um, how about some sake? Uh, no, I'll have a whiskey and soda, please. Uh, no ice, of course. <laughs> uh, uh, come. <cunt. laughs> please sit down, Mr. Tamora. Please do. Tell me, Mr. Tamura, I'm uh, very curious about something. I, I didn't know that in Japan they taught English with an Oxford accent. Uh, they don't, uh, but they do at Oxford. Oh. <laughs> well, I, I hope you learned to like Japanese food at Oxford, because that's what we're having. <laughs> oh, I'm not that westernized. Uh, even though I employ a French chef, I still enjoy our native food. Well, shall we have our tea out in the garden of the August moon? Uh, shall let's show Mr. Tamura the way. All right, Mr. Tamura, I find the cocktail hour delightful. Uh, do not you? Oh, yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> uh, is that uh, Miss Potter or Mrs.? Neither. It's Ms. But I'm not married, which is what you wanted to know. <laughs> Your sister's candor is refreshing. Say, he's really a charmer, isn't he? Yeah, too bad he's not an American. He'd be the summer replacement for Henry Kissinger. <laughs> Shall we uh, turn to the patio for some uh, brandy and cigars? <clears throat> oh, I would uh, enjoy a breath of air. A most delicious Japanese dinner, Mrs. Sims. Thank you, and I'd be very happy to give the recipe to your French chef. Uh, uh, wh where are you going? Out on the patio. Since when do you smoke cigars? <laughs> Mr. Tamura and I have some business matters to discuss. Oh, there's no rush. There's plenty of time for that. Well, I, I thought you were planning to return home in a few days. Oh, plans are always subject to change. I have been thinking. In fact, I have more or less decided to extend my visit. Good. Darling, why are you getting so worked up? Uh, uh, she and Mr. Tamora are having the time of their lives. Uh, don't you think Charlotte deserves that? I'd like to give her what she deserves. <laughs> She's kept him tied up for a whole week, and JJ's due back tomorrow. What am I going to tell him? That I couldn't talk to Tamora because it's the mating season at Sun City? <laughs> Mom and Dad, I don't know if I should tell you this or not, but uh, we've got a problem. Well, what's the problem? Well, I found this postcard out on the patio, and it must have fallen out of Mr. Tamura's coat pocket. I know I shouldn't have read it, but I just couldn't resist the temptation to practice my Japanese. Well, read it to me. Paul, that's an invasion of privacy. Not if he's practicing his Japanese. <laughs> uh, dear Shiro, we all miss you very much and eagerly await your return. We hope your business has met with success and look forward to seeing you soon. And it's signed, Sosho. Was that a man or woman's name? Well, in the P.S., it says, the doctor says I'm pregnant and the baby will be born in late spring. I think we can assume it's a woman. Unless they found the eighth wonder. <laughs> There's another P.S. The children and I miss you very much. He's married, an expectant father, and he's playing around with my sister. That's the problem. I don't know how you want to handle it. Oh, Paul, this is going to break Charlotte's heart. Well, there's only one sensible thing to do. Get her down here, level with her, and break her heart. <laughs> and 
And while you're doing that... <laughs> I'll go out and check the pool for cracks. Paul, you come back here. She is your sister, and you've got to tell her. Martha, she's got a brown belt in kung fu. <laughs> but she won't strike a woman. Paul. Wait a minute. Wouldn't it be perfect if she just left of her own accord? Well, sure, but how are you going to get her to do that? Well, remember, I think it's better if uh, you don't know. <laughs> Mind if I use your phone? Ours is going to be busy in a second. <laughs> They're in another world. Howie, as long as you're meditating, think about ways of getting a job. Hello? Hello. May I speak with Charlotte Potter, please? This is the carefree canine kennel of Carmel calling. Just a minute. Charlotte, it's the kennel and Carmel. Kennel? Oh, dear. I hope nothing's wrong. Hello, this is Charlotte Potter. Is anything wrong? Well, it's just that Buster hasn't been eating. And I think he's coming down with a dry nose. Oh, 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 oh. Polly, you do a very bad Buster. What a bird. Uh, Charlotte. When is Mr. Tomorrow coming? Oh, in about an hour. Why? Would you do me a big favor? Stay upstairs till I call you. I uh, want to have a few words with him. Oh, about your business deal? Uh, among other things. Okay? <laughs> of course, Polly. <laughs> Thanks for the use of the phone. Oh, they can't hear. I hate you. <laughs> Paul, I hope that when Mr. Tamura arrives, you are not going to beat around the bush. You know, you're talking to one of the best trial lawyers in the business. When I finish my summation speech to the jury, they yell, encore, encore. <laughs> and when I show him the evidence, uh, what, what did I do with that postcard? Oh, I must have left it in my jacket. I'll, I'll get it. Oh, wait a minute, Paul, that might be him. It's okay, just keep him occupied. I'll be right down. That's Paul. Good evening, Mrs. Sims. Good evening. How very lovely you look. Thank you. Well, it's gotten rather chilly, eh? Yes, it has. Uh, will Charlotte be down soon? Yes, she will. Now, please sit down. Uh, Mr. Tamura, do you have a very large family? I'm speaking of your immediate family. Oh, I'm very sorry to say that I have none. My wife and I, unfortunately, were childless. What about your second wife? But I have never remarried. No. Well, tell me, Mr. Tamura, does the name Socho ring a bell? Oh, yes, yes, of course. That's my sister's name. Your sister? Oh, uh, uh, excuse me, Mr. Tamura. I have to talk to my husband. Uh, make yourself a drink. There's a case of sake behind the bar. <laughs> <laughs> you lecher. I beg your pardon? Uh, you let your mustache grow a little, didn't you? <laughs> Mr. Tamora, when you met my sister, did you or did you not? Make some references to the fact that she reminded you of your late wife. May I ask? Answer you... yes or no. <laughs> yes, yes, but, but... What I want to know is this. How late is your wife? I beg your pardon. Let's strike that. Oh, I've got to talk to you. Uh, just hold it. Uh... I have in my possession an exhibit, I mean, a postcard, containing concrete evidence that your supposedly late wife is pregnant. 
May I ask Paul, you? Oh, the card is from his sister. What? His sister's name is Socho, and she is pregnant. And so, Martha. <laughs> a shadow of a doubt that our son-in-law is not to be trusted. <laughs> You'll have to forgive my husband, Mr. Tamora. He's such a, a good lawyer. He loves to practice at home. <clears throat> Where is your charming sister? Charlotte, are you ready? I'll be right there. Thank you so much, Mrs. Sims. You've been a most gracious hostess. Should you ever come to Kyoto, you must call me. Oh, uh, Mr. Tamura, you, 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 you talk like you're leaving. I am, on the morning flight to Japan. But what about our business here? Your, your, your corporate base are uh, representing you. I'm afraid that is no longer possible. What? what? Well, why? Mr. Sims, I may have English clothes and a French cook, but I am still an Oriental. By thinking that I was capable of dishonorable behavior toward your sister, you have lost face with me. At the same time, because of what you suspected, I have lost face with you. Two faceless people cannot do business together. <laughs> I'll wear a mask. <laughs> Charming. Uh, Charlotte, Mr. Tamura was just telling us he's going to Japan in the morning. Oh, really? What a shame. Nothing wrong with your sister, is there? No, 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 no. Something else has come up. Goodbye again. Goodbye, Mr. Tamura. Well, uh, since this is our last evening together, I must talk to you about what you've been paying the girls in your mills. I think it's a disgrace. Charlotte. Yes? Watch your face. <laughs> You're gonna lose it. Sorry. It's all right. Oh! You hurt yourself. That's okay. Right now I could use little Harry Carey. I used to buy a pickle. It only used to cost a nickel. And a bus ride only used to cost a dime. That's a look. Them days can be forgotten, the world has gotten rotten. Lots of luck, lots of luck, lots of luck. Every day it's getting tougher, and it keeps on getting rougher. A dollar isn't even worth that.